PC Crash 13.0 has a convolutional neural net based equivalent energy speed estimator. So a database of crash photos was used with estimates of the EES to train the neural network. Uh, so you can load in photos of your crash vehicle and it can give you an estimate of the uh, EES. So you can see I've got the module open here in PC Crash and I've got a rear end collision with three different photos loaded in. I'll just check to show the estimate on each one. So you can see this particular one results in a pretty high confidence of uh, uh, EES in the 25 to 30 kilometer per hour range. Adding this one, you know, it gets a little bit bimodal. And then this one here, oh, it gets quite a bit different. So let's just take a look at why this one is giving such a low delta V compared to the other. So if I double click on the picture, you see a heat map of the features that are being used to, or like sort of where it's looking, what it's do, estimating this on. So you can see this corner damage is what's creating that 25 to 30, whereas the other corner, it's looking at the relatively undamaged side of the other side of the bumper. So that one is not particularly useful for the estimate. So this is estimating something either in the 15 to 20 or 25 to 30 range. And the uh, EDR on this particular vehicle registered a 21K uh, rear end speed change. So it's kind of in the ballpark. Uh, this feature I would say is still beta, but uh, you could use it to kind of get some estimates of what, where your uh, severity might be. So machine learning in PC Crash 13.0.